Gilgit-Baltistan, the northernmost of Pakistan's territory, holds a unique biogeographic place in the world. Nature has shaped this region with towering mountains, immense glaciers, and grand river valleys. It is here where three of the greatest mountain ranges in the world, the Himalayas, the Karakoram, and the Hindu Kush collide. The mountains of Gilgit-Baltistan are fragile ecosystems, which are globally significant as a vital watershed of the world, rich in biodiversity and a popular destination for travelers. Gilgit-Baltistan houses the largest glacial mass outside the polar region, which serves as a vital source for the Indus River. Nowhere else is such a dramatic concentration of high mountains, which provide an ecological backdrop to many endangered species. The region nurtures some of the last remaining arid conifer forests in the greater Himalayan mountain chain. A range of globally significant species are found in this region, most notably the endangered snow leopard and the flare-horned markhor. It is also an important stronghold for the Himalayan ibex, Lada Uriel, Marco Polo sheep, Himalayan brown bear, and a host of other wildlife species. The efforts made by Gilgit Baltasan's forests, parks, and wildlife department and development partners, alongside the support of the local resident communities, has ensured the protection of the region's natural environment. Such developments have contributed to the recent improvement of the conservation status of the Markur in the IUCN Red List, which presently is no longer listed as threatened. Seven national parks have been created in Gilgit-Baltistan, each one a hotspot for many of the region's rare, endemic, and flagship species. The Central Karakoram National Park is the highest national park in the world and the largest protected area in Pakistan. CKNP rises in altitude from 2,000 meters to the summit of K2 the park encompasses the longest glaciers outside the polar regions, making up 40% of the park area. The Kunjarab National Park is Pakistan's third largest national park and also one of the highest altitude parks in the world. The primary purpose of setting up the park was to provide protection to the endangered Marco Polo sheep which is only found in this area of Pakistan. The park is also famous for one of the rarest wild cats in the world, the snow leopard. The Kunjarab National Park contains the highest density of these endangered wild cats in the northern areas of Pakistan. The introduction of the carnivores conservation program through launching of livestock insurance scheme and with better anti-poaching enforcement, coupled with the significant upturn in Makor and Ibex populations, the snow leopard is better protected and expected to increase in numbers. The Himalayan Ibex is also widely distributed and abundant in the park, but absent from neighboring China. The park is a sanctuary to a number of endangered and threatened species, making it one of the most important alpine biodiversity regions within Pakistan. The Deosai National Park is also a key nature reserve, which was established with the primary objective to protect the Himalayan brown bear in its natural habitat and also to maintain the ecological balance of the Deosai Plateau. The Deosai Plains are amongst the highest plateaus in the world, 
which sustain a remnant population of Himalayan brown bears in South Asia. When the park was created in 1993, only 19 brown bears were recorded. However, due to stringent conservation efforts, the population has increased up to 90 bears in the park. The Krumbar and Handrap Shandur National Parks, situated in the Palmyra Range, are highly unique and precious landscapes. The creation of two new high-altitude parks, the Nanga Parvat National Park and the Himalaya National Park, were specially inaugurated by Prime Minister Imran Khan under his Protected Areas Initiative. The network of national parks across Gilgit Baltistan serves as a sanctuary and refuge for many rare and endemic species found in the region. The region's precious natural resources mark the conservation of biodiversity crucial not only for the region, but also for the world.